Hello friends, we are going to discuss random module in python. The python random module are random number generators. A random number is a number that is generated by chance, that is generated randomly. To use random module in python program, it needs to be imported using the import command. So in your program, you have to give import random to import the random module. Three most common random number generator function in random module are given here. The first one is random function. It returns a random floating point number n in the range between 0.0, .0 to 1.0. Lower bound 0, 0.0, upper bound 1.0. So it is shown here. Random a comma b randint is a function we can pass a value a and b it returns a random integer n in the range of a and b that is means n is lesser than or equal to a is greater than or equal to a or lesser than or equal to b so here rand range function start stop and step it returns the random number from start to stop with the step value so we'll see some how these functions are working. First, to generate a random floating point number, you have to use impo, you have to use the random dot random function. So first you have to import the random module for this. Next, to generate a random floating point number between the range lower to upper bound using the random function, you have to do some steps. That is, multiply the random with the difference of upper limit with the lower limit that is upper minus lower and add add it to the lower limit for example i want to generate a random number between between 15 to 35 so how to write so you have to import the random module in your program so random dot random function into upper limit 35 minus 15 plus the lower value 15 for example if uh, how it was i will tell you uh, random dot random generate 0 it means so here 0 into 35 minus 15 is 20 is 20 into 20 is 0 plus 15 the low, lower bound 15 will be the result if the random dot random generate 1 that means here we will get it 1 into 20 plus 35 35 will be the result so for this purpose we are using this formula to generate a random integer 15, between 15 to 35 we have to use the randint function random dot randint 15 comma 35 so it will return a, an integer number between 15 to 35. So lower than 15 to 35 it will return a, a random integer number. So we will see the demo. So first we have to import random module. Next I am printing random dot The random function save the program and execute the program now the output is 0 0.166 so it is in the range of 0 0.0 to 1.0 next we have to generate a random floating point number random dot random generate a floating point number next we are going to generate a random floating point number random dot random function into the upper bound okay i want to generate a value floating number between 30 50 to 35 so upper bound minus lower bound 15 plus 15 execute the program i'll come to the previous one execute the program see i am getting a value Okay, 26.913. Okay, again, I'm running the program. Now I'm getting 20.529. I'm getting a value in the range of 15 to 35. Next. So we are going to discuss how to use random function. Print. Print. Random dot 
rand int a and b so i want to generate a value between the integer number 15 to 35 so we will the program will check the output so now i am getting 24 so in this way 15 to 24 again i am running a program i am getting 33 so in the range of 15 to 35 for example i am changing my range i want to generate number 10 to 100 okay in this case i am getting an integer 96 so in this way the rand int will work so, to accurately see the the latest statement only I am commenting all the previous statement. Now we will use the step print random dot okay. random range step. I am giving 10 to 50. Step value is 5. You check how it works. Okay. Generate a value 20 within the range of 10 to 50, and it will the value increase the value. The step it will increase the value with the 5 only. The step will be 5. Again, I will run the program. It's 15. Again, I will run the program. It's 15. Again, I am running. It generate 30. Okay. See, okay, it will what to say 20. It will 10 to 15, okay, the range will be the gap, okay, the value will be uh, in the step of 5. So, 20 and 15, take 30, so everything is divided divide by uh, 5 as a reminder, 0. So, in this way, the RAND range will work. So, these are all the functions of the few functions of the random module we discussed in, the, in, the, in this video lecture. So, these are random function, random function, it will return a floating point value. Uh, random dot random okay, random is a module random is a function okay then to generate a floating point number between the uh, lower limit to upper limit we have to give random dot random multiply of upper limit minus lower limit plus lower limit then to generate an integer between the lower to upper value we have to give a random dot random we have to pass the value so to random range function you have to uh, mention the lower and upper bound along with the step value so these are the program we have discussed so uh, this is the way we have discussed all the Four functions are discussed very clearly. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, share, comment and press the bell button. Thank you.